Hi my loves, welcome back to a new video. So today I'm gonna to be trying some Amazon lashes. I've been dying to try these. So many of you asked like, what are my favorite lashes? Like, are there any affordable ones? And some lashes that I do really love are like Ilo, Classy Lashes UK. Those are ones that I use a lot. I also really love, love, love Huda Beauty lashes. They're so, so nice. Tati lashes are good. There's just so many that I've tried that are amazing. But do you know what? We ain't all got seven pounds or seven to 10 pounds to put on one pair of lashes, you know? Even though that's kind of affordable, like some lashes are like 30 pounds but there are some packs on amazon and i'm guessing on ebay as well like where you can just buy a whole set and it's like six seven pounds which is a bargain your girl's all about saving some coin and some of these lashes actually look like the high-end ones sometimes i got some pretty good ones here like like some pretty good ones um i'm so excited so yeah it's kind of gonna be like this first impression lash try on video which i've never done before <sighs> i'm kind of scared about the glue but it's okay so today's post notification shout out is gonna go to charlene nana so thank you so much for your really sweet comment i really appreciate it if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button let me know in the comments below or you can just leave a nice comment so yeah if you want to see how these lashes look like on me keep on watching i had these mini scissors yeah these mini scissors that were perfect for trimming lashes no no don't know where it's gone i have no idea zero nada for glue today i'm going to be using the huda beauty sticky tack lash glue now this is a clear glue but it's very long wearing like this stays sticky the whole day like it's clear so like if your lash comes off like you can just stick it back on although with this like that's never happened because it's that like sticky but i think the first lashes that i'm going to try are from jameer they're vegan lashes, cruelty free, okay. I mean, there's no style name to be honest, but of course, like I'll link everything in the info box. But these ones look really, really nice. They're super fluffy and they seem long enough for me. So yeah, let's try this on. So with any like pair of lash that I open up um, that I haven't put on before, I like to just place it on my lid like this quickly and just to see how this looks. And there's a lot like hanging off the edge. So I definitely need to trim this for sure. I really don't like having my lash come all the way into the inner corner. Like I do it like literally just off it. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to trim these a little bit. You just have to see like where it ends at the end of your lashes. And then just roughly cut a section off. I'm literally doing this with my kitchen scissors because I cannot find my little trimming scissors. Okay, so this one should now fit a little bit better. That's so fluffy, oh my god. Mm, look at the difference though. Yeah, so that one I'm happy with. And then you could just measure the other one against this one so that they're equal. You don't want some funky looking eyes, okay? I'm just waiting for my glue to dry. I find that tweezers are like the best thing to put lashes on. I forgot how good this lash glue is, but it was really easy to stick these on guys. I mean, these are definitely really fluffy. Like they're very out there. I don't know if I like, like I wish it was just a little bit shorter towards the inner corner. Um, like this bit is like really long, but you know, I do feel like I need a little bit of mascara on my lower lashes. With like heavy lashes like these, they don't feel heavy at all though. But when they're like really full, like I have to have like full bottom lashes. Because if I don't, I just feel a little bit naked. Like I just feel awkward. Like it's something that's not right. No, these are pretty. What do you guys think? I like these. Here's just a little close up. I really like them they're so full like this with a full glam i try to keep my make my eye makeup as bare as possible so that the focus can be on the lashes but i would rate these like a good eight out of ten i i wish this was like less longer in the inner corner but you know you could trim that a bit 
um, they're so easy to put on I like the band they're not too thick and they yeah they just fit right onto my um, lid and I love the fluffiness and fullness of it I like the length and um, this with like a full glam on to the next one Woo! You do have to be careful when you pull them out because I literally tried pulling one out and broke it. So <gasps> I feel naked when my lashes gone. You get five pairs of lashes here. That's really not bad. Really happy with that one. I'm legit scared of these next ones. I did not, when I saw that, I was like, what the hell? I don't remember buying anything like this. It didn't look like this when I was buying it. So I don't think these ones are for me, but we'll try it anyways. But look at them bad boys. Oh my god, literal spider legs, I feel like. <laughs> you could legit prank someone with these. Okay, the lash brand is actually not too bad. I like to just like curl them like this before I fit them onto my eye. And then... Oh Lord Jesus Christ. What? See, because the Huda Beauty lash glue is there, like this is just stuck on. <laughs> Like literally, these are on, like, I don't even need to do anything. I don't even need to trim them or anything. Yeah, I just don't see myself eating them. Even trimmed, like, I just don't, I just don't see myself. But yeah, these ones actually fit my length, my lid really well. I'm just gonna fix my... Oh so weird it's like literally <laughs> oh my god i mean what do you guys think do you know what i feel like some people can pull these off like it actually does suit them but for me it's a no it's a no <laughs> they are massive <laughs> no 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 <laughs> Yeah, these are just a no for me. Okay, let's just take them out. <laughs> no, 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 no. Next up, we've got, I think they're from the same brand, but these look a bit more wearable for me. They look wispy and kind of like fluffy. Not as fluffy as the first one, but they look cool. Let's curl it up a bit. And then... Oh, these ones fit really well for me. I don't think I need to trim these at all. Okay, these are what these ones look like and they're actually way more wearable. I love these. <gasps> they're pretty. They look like high-end ones. Like you wouldn't realize that these are like affordable lashes. They look so nice and wispy. Oh, I like these. Again, I didn't even need to put glue. It's a bit loose in some bits because I haven't put more glue. I'm trying to like preserve my natural lashes and not shove them with a lot of glue, but yeah, the glue's amazing. I think I've said that enough times in this video, but yeah, these lashes are good. I definitely would rate them like, I'll give these a nine out of 10 because they're so lightweight. They, I don't even need to trim them. They fit me well and they're like really wispy and fluffy. And I, I love like lashes instead of just being all full, I like them when they kind of go like that. So yeah, these ones are so nice guys. Let me do a close up. Nice, right? Ignore it if it's not like proper neat application. So yeah, really happy with that one. On to the next. What's crazy about these packets is that you get 10 pairs of lashes. Bargain. I'm really happy with those ones. Definitely see myself wearing these. So next up, I got this one in this box that comes like, comes like this. Oh, these ones are a bit different. They just look like really wispy lashes. If you guys can see, you'll see that there's a lot of string hanging out and I need to trim that for sure. Oh my God, these are like so thin. I don't know how I feel about them. Yeah, I don't think I need to trim any of like the actual lash, but just the bits hanging out. <sighs> I'm not feeling these ones. They're, they're like really straight and really hard to maneuver. Especially when I'm trying to glue it into the inner corner. I'm really not feeling these at all. <sighs> they just look like really long singular armpit hairs on my eyeballs. This one's looking like weird as well. Like it's making my eye look funky. Like you can barely see them. Like they're, they're literally touching my eye brow. 
and they're so long and thin, like, what's the point? What is the point of these type of lashes? I don't get it. Take this shit off. Ew. Definitely won't fit in those, for sure. I'm not gonna even rate those because I don't even like them. And then finally, we have this last pack again. These are like nice wispy ones. Uh, you get five pairs. Oh, it contains tweezers as well. Oh yeah, you do get like a lash tweezer now, which I actually do need. But these are what these ones look like. Can you see like all that glue on there that I have to take off and it's really thick. The band on this one is definitely thicker than the others. No, oh, these ones fit perfectly. And also I find that when there's a slightly thicker band, the lash is way easier to put on. Okay, weirdly enough, I had to trim a little bit on the right eye and my eye is starting to water a little bit, but we're on the last pair, so it's all good. Yeah, so these are the last pair, and they're actually really pretty. I like these ones. I definitely see myself wearing these, like, for every day, sort of, like, casual makeup. Um, the only downside to these is that there was a bit of a, there was quite a bit of glue when I pulled them off the packet, but they're easy, it's easy to take off. The band is actually easy to shape and, like, place on your eye there's no like fiddling around because i find that when i have a thinner lash band i'm just literally sat there for an hour trying to put my lashes on um but these look pretty they complement my eyes really well they're long enough um they're not too long they're fluffy um there is a one random strand just sticking out don't do this at home guys but i'm just gonna trim that My eyeliner is probably all over the place, but it's all good. Oh, Luna looks really fluffy. Are you clean? So yeah, guys, overall, I've been really happy. My favorite were definitely number one and three for sure. These ones are okay. They didn't stand out to me, but they're nice. They're really affordable. So yeah, but one and three were like really really nice so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this lash try on let me know if there's any other like amazon stuff that you'd like me to try uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed subscribe to my channel i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next video bye